Good morning, everybody. Um, just want to come on and do a project share. If you'll remember, this is the uh, tag album that I made with my paper stack for Kill the Paper Stack Challenge by Laura Loves Lace. And um, I needed a box for it. And uh, so I've made a box and a card. And I'll show you the card first. It's just real simple. Here comes Tesla because he's curious. And it's just um, two sheets of paper, and um, this is a different paper than the um, challenge was because I, you know, I don't have very many pieces left of it. So I pulled out some more flowery paper and I used it to cover the box and make the card. So this is the card, and it's just it's just plain white on the inside. I'm going to write a note. Oops. And so there's the card that I made, and I put one of my um, handmade flowers on there, and it's got some pearl bling, and um, this is just layered patterned paper here and here, and then I made a little banner. And I'm hoping this will pick up because it's early morning, and um, the sun's not up enough, and I'm trying. So I'm hoping this isn't too dark. If it is too bad, I will do it again. Okay, so now let's look at the box. And, um, ooh, might have to back up. I made the box out of chipboard. And I used Jim the Gentleman Crafter's tip of using um, strips of paper that you um, fold and use it to go around the corners. And um, I'll have pictures on my blog of what that looked like. And, um, so you can see what it looked like when the box was naked <laughs> before I started decorating it. Okay, and I've covered it with a, some striped paper, some of the pink paper, and some of this floral paper. Okay, and um, it's fully lined, and if I can uh, get it, I'll take the lid off and show you the inside in a minute, but I'm going to finish with the trims first. These are flatback pearls that I got from Saw Crafters, and um, you get a big um, ream of them for like seven dollars or something, or seven ninety nine. I can't remember, but um, I love these. I need to order some more. And then I've got some white gimp trim here. The pearls are a cream. The gimp trim is white. I put on this kind of a sage green beaded trim that I had in my stash. It's got some clear beads with the sage green. And then this is my favorite lace. And um, this is going to someone very special. And um, we're growing to appreciate each other's friendship. So I hope she'll like it. And um, I've got, like I said, like six to eight inches left of this. This is my favorite lace, and that's all I've got left. And um, let me see. On the bottom, I just put a piece of white uh, cardstock and stamped my uniquely handmade, and then I put my name and my YouTube channel. So that's the box that I made right there. And on the inside, it's fully lined. See? Fully lined with the paper. And I had an issue, I don't know if you'll be able to tell or not, but I had it where the paper didn't quite make. So I did, just like I did to reinforce the chipboard, I took strips of the pattern paper and then folded it and fitted it down along the edges. And you can't tell where I messed up, I don't think. Not, not really clearly. But um, that's got a small dot print on it. Set this down here. And then the inside of the box, I used a larger dot on the sides and the smaller dot on the bottom. And that's how I lined that. Um, on the top, where the, the paper on the top piece that comes down, it folds over the edge and then is covered with the, in, in the lining paper. And that's what I did here, too. I folded the paper I used on the outside to the inside of the box, see how that is, and then covered it. So, and then this goes back on here, just like that. 
and um, it's completely handmade from scratch. And I just use heavy chipboard, and it, I think this box is actually stronger than the uh, photo boxes that you get at Joann's and Michael's and such. So I hope who this is going to will like it and enjoy it. And um, I'm going to be mailing out some things this week, and um, some are going to be real surprises for some people. And that's all I have to share this morning. Thanks for watching. Bye now.